Hey everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips. So as you can see, I'm on the Plasma desktop. It's one of, it's one of my favorite desktop environments, but even if it's one of my favorites, it still has problems. And one of the biggest problems is that sometimes the panel crashes, or, or as I should say, the entire shell crashes the desktop. And there's really nothing you can do about it because there's no reset mechanism like on GNOME where you can just type in R and reset. So in this video, I'm going to go over how you can set up a reset system and we're going to create a script. So open up a terminal window and uh, from here you can go ahead and uh, type in the touch command and let me zoom in so it's easier to see and type in touch panel restart. Now this will create a panel restart script. From here you can do echo followed by bin bash and this will go into the panel restart file. And as you can see if I cat panel restart we see we have the shebang here. Next thing we need to do is we need to add in the kill command. And uh, you can add it with the echo commands in the article in the description. Or if you're feeling brave, like I am, you can open up panel restart in the nano text editor. So we need to do kill all and then just plasma shell. From there, you can do another line. And do plasma shell and now the and sign is important this and sign will let the system know that it's okay to continue and just run it and move on to the background so uh, once you've got that you can go ahead and save the edit or if you've used the echo commands and you don't need to save it because it should be already written in there exit this and then update the permissions. So the permissions are updated with chmod. So sudo chmod plus x panel restart. Now you can run this instantly with just this command here. And as you can see, it killed the shell entirely and reset it. And then you can just press control C and uh, get that out of the way. And that will restart everything. But uh, for convenience sake, we need to place the script in the bin directory. Now, some people have debated with me, you shouldn't put your own scripts in the bin directory. I'm just used to putting it there and it works fine, but you can also put it in user lib bin or whatever, or user share or whatever you want to put it in. But uh, just do sudo mv panel restart and then user bin. Now from here, if we type in and we press alt F2 to open up the launcher and we type in panel restart, is going to automatically restart the shell and there you go now in the description of this art of this video i wrote an article that goes over how you can set a keyboard shortcut to automatically restart the, the panel for me i don't really need a shortcut when i'm using kde the command is just enough but uh definitely something to look into anyways guys i hope this has helped you if you're dealing with crashing on kde and you want to learn how to reset it anyways guys i gotta get going but i hope but I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.